Thanks for watching Coco Vlogs. I want my mommy. I have cooties. I don't feel good. Has anybody out there ever been like dehydrated from either drinking too much beer, too much soda, too much anything? Like, oh my god. I had a pain on my right side. I thought I was in labor again. Oh my god. It was bad. Like, every time I breathed in, the side of my, the, literally the side of my, what is that? Whatever's on your right side, it was hurting. Whatever it was. Excuse the way I look because I I look rough and I don't feel good so I don't really care. But anyway, I literally, so I'm already, I already have flu symptoms on top of being dehydrated. So I got a big ass, excuse me, for the kids. I got a big tumbler cup. Really big. I filled it up with water. I drank the whole thing. Legit. Before 45 minutes, I already had to pee. That's one thing about my bladder. It's totally gone. But anywho. So, I'm probably about to just go lay down for a second before these kids get home from school. And totally ruin it. Because I won't be able to take a nap. So. Yeah. Oh, by the way. Hi, guys. Welcome to Coco Blow. <sighs> I'm gonna lay down. I feel like crap. I don't know why I'm vlogging, but <sighs> how are you guys doing today? Comment below what you do when you're sick. I mean, I take vitamins. I drink that. Um, what do you call it? I drink that stuff that's emergency. It's nasty, but I mean, it helps. But me, my husband, and my son have been passing flu symptoms back and forth. Like, my husband a little, has a little head cold right now. My son was sick. Thank God he was on fall break, so it didn't really affect him like that. And uh, we're just passing germs back and forth, and oh my gosh. I want some faux noodles. Somebody bring me some noodles. Sometimes I feel like I'm a hypochondriac because I really feel like legit. I always think something's wrong with me. but And nobody believes me because they feel like, yeah, whatever. You got too many complaints. My mom called me a hypochondriac. So, I don't know. Maybe I am. I don't know. But all I know is I feel like crap. And the least I could do is get a break, right? I take care of everybody. Yes, babe. Say hi. What's hi. that? Hi. Good. Stop, babe. You're next to my ear. Scoot back a little. Thank you. Actually, I'm in Mommy. his bed anyway. It's actually a bunk bed, so. <laughs> Don't judge me, but it's comfortable. I like it better than my bed because it's hard, and I don't like beds that are too soft. But anyway, I just feel like <sighs> I just have that head cold feeling like I'm floating, like my head is stuffed. Migraine. I think I better try and take a nap before my kids get home from school because they're going to be loud. Can I have a snack? I'm hungry. They're going to start yelling and fighting and I'm going to be yelling, do your homework, get to your homework. And my son, he struggles with ADHD so I have to kind of like put him in the other room. He's not allowed to watch TV or nothing. Like none of them are but if the TV's on, he will not get nothing done. Homework, nothing. So, the struggle is real. We struggle, we struggle. Struggle to help him with that because we're having... Like, I was just telling my husband, like, there should be a class because for parents who go through stuff like that with their children, like, you don't know what to do. You're just winging it. They don't have a, a handbook for what you're supposed to do. I, I don't want to treat my son different than any of the rest of my kids, but it's still, like... A struggle so well I'm gonna end this vlog and thank you for listening to my little sick rant thank you for watching bye